Imagine, we are on our own. I am taking care of my children single-handedly. It's better for me to scam people, to scam, to follow you, to scam people, scam their land, scam their properties. It's better for me to join you and bury shams and do despicable things. I, I renounce and denounce you. I can't be part of nonsense. I don't know where that will lead my life, my destiny to. I refuse to join your fraternity and not too much. I refuse to join your fraternity only to run your stupid church, a Beniza power ministry. I refuse because I want life. I want a normal life for my kids. How can my kids go through this nonsense? And yet you are not satisfied. You are a wicked man. The devil is better than you. I will keep saying it. The devil is very holy. The devil is better than you. I have not seen anybody, anything like you. You are wicked. Even if you want to do anything or you want to marry or you want to go ahead with your life, why do you want to bring me into what the shit you are doing? Do I care? Do I care? I don't even care. I've moved on long ago. You know it. Living with you is better. Is living with the devil is far better than living with you. A pastor that takes his own children, are you the only pastor into it? Yes, they protect their home. Yes, they protect their own, their members. But you take, suck blood, drink blood, eat your own. Let this thing that happens today repeat itself again. Hey, God, I passed my message. I called you. I called your line direct to talk to you. You didn't pick. I called you and I sent you a text. You didn't reply. And I want to pass my message here. Since I have no option, let me go online and pass my message to you and to your cohorts. I will bring you people down. If, if, if you makes me more annoyed, I will start calling names. But let me not call names. It is you that I live with. I know. I married you. I didn't marry them. So I will hold you. It is you. Try that nonsense again with my son. Try that nonsense again. I am taking care of my I'm hustling. Doing business. Trying to put food on my table to feed my children, pay their school fees. I'm proud to do that as a single mother. And now you want to, oh my goodness, of ah, yeah, yeah. It's like, eh, wrong. Because now it's me that is pushing you. You are mad. You are mad. You've been doing that. I was quiet. This morning is only God. The God that you made me. To reject and hated. That same God that saved us. <clears throat> Look at my son. My second child is there. Joshua, do you want to talk? I don't want to expose my kids to social media. I've been avoiding that. I want peace for these children. I want these children to rest after what they saw, after what they've been through. After what this boy saw in your wardrobe, the thing is still tormenting this boy. And now you want, what do you want? What do you want? You are threatening, you've been threatening us. You've been threatening our lives. Telling people, oh my goodness, people have been calling me. He finished out this other me. That, 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 that's not my, I don't see that. I, 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 that's not my business. I pray that whatsoever I'm, what my ex, I pray that whatever, whatsoever I'm experiencing today, may nobody experience it. Be you my enemy because I know what I'm passing through, even to today. I challenged you and you wanted to kill everybody because I spoke up. And let me tell you and your cohorts, you and those your faith pastors, friends, honestly, I will still run my mouth. I go open up. I go still blow it open. I've challenged you, say, it's like I bring it off. You started this. I left. I didn't say a word. And you want to use me to build your church back. You want to use me and get married to another woman. That's okay. That's fine. I let another woman go and eat the soup and the salad and vegetable. I've been eating while in your house. Kai, I so much love that. I want them to come and sit and see 
and eat. I am not blocking you to do anything. Then why are you still not satisfied? Why are you still dragging me? Why are you still trying to kill me and my children? Now, the reverse is the case. Because it's me that will push you. You are a wicked man. You are a wicked man. Who does that? Who? In another planet, who even does that? Talk more of here. Try that nonsense again. And see what will be the outcome of everything. I will tell you that, honestly, a dead woman cannot die again. 